What's a poppin' Pisces? I'm Laurel and welcome to Love Pisces in this mother sucker baby. Join me as I read you you all's lives. This is gonna be Who's Mad? Brought to you by Michael motherfucking Jackson. Check that description box if you need to get a personal reading from me. You can text me at 281-932-3218. You can also check out my website, laurelsmoon.com. All right, Pisces. I'm over here pondering. I'm at the beautiful water jungles. <laughs> and um, I've been pulling cards to see what the preview was going to be about. And a bitch had to clutch my coochie pearls. Yes, I did. So, with that being said, I'm going to be talking about your partner, your person, your shoulda, woulda, couldas, have nots, maybes, possiblys, whatever the case may be. If your ass is sensitive, go on and click the fuck on off and check that ADHD at the door, baby. Because I'm going to be giving you a real ass motherfucker read today. I had to sit, I had to rise up from my casket. When I was reading these cards. So. One of your people got me a little fucked up. I'm pretty sure you're going to know exactly who the fuck I'm talking about in this reading. Oh child, let me get my lips together. I want to look like I've been smoking dope for 50 million years, honey. So listen. One of these raggedy, dusty, dust mites, mammoth back built bitches is feeling some type of way. This could be somebody that you've had dealings with on a temporary or a long term. But the very first card that came out was blood. So. Blood can mean many different things. It could be one of the most powerful spells. And I feel like either somebody wanted to tap into your DNA or they wanted blood instead of tears. I feel like this could have been someone that um, was close to you at some point in time. You also have sour. So somebody tried to sour a situation, make things um, ugly for you. And that's that hot pepper. They wanted things to be quick, fast, and in a motherfucking hurry. So let me go ahead and save these cards for all of my Piscean guys before. I go off because I'm feeling some type of way about this energy that I'm picking up on. You got witch bombs here too and silent winds. So let's see what's up for all of my Pisces spirit. Go ahead and pull on up. You must sage the cards for all of my Piscean gods, baby. All right, so in the air, in the smoke, I was getting what muck, what goes up must come down. So I do feel like some of you guys could have been dealing with an energy where they were very spiteful and wanting you to fail at each and every single thing that you did. But they wanted those powers that they wanted to make a weakness for you. So this could be a friend, a foe, a dusty ass hoe. Okay? <laughs> Bitch, don't make me go Dr. Seuss on that hoe. So listen. I feel like anything that was thrown your way, you surpassed it. And this person is reminiscent on why they couldn't get to you. 
why they weren't able to rub you the wrong way. This could be your enthusiasm, your gains, your fame. I feel like some of you guys came from the littlest of nothing. Going on your faith, your godliness, whoever it is you believe in. And people try to tear that down as well, too. I also feel like um, someone has tried to ruin your um, reputation. Okay, by word of mouth or speaking about certain things that they don't know nothing about. Alright, so I'm going to get this witchy deck last. You have narc demons. All right, okay. So, somebody's narcissistic demons wanted to get the best of you. And they didn't know how to achieve that. So, they're mad about it. Also, this could be somebody, a close relative... Bitch got the Red Bull for this. Okay. Let's dumpster dive. Scamming still as I'm splitting the deck. So they couldn't lie to you. They couldn't scam you. They couldn't try to bamboozle you as well. Or let you join in on their cult or whatever way of life that they feel is best. All right, we already got at night falling out. Give me some more for my Pisces spirit. Blow up. Okay, and rich at the bottom of the deck. I told you I had to clutch my coochie pearls with this one. I feel like somebody knows um, that they can't reach certain things if you that you've excelled in. Yeah, this remind me of um, when this is how I know that the ancestors be watching over me. Ever since I was a little girl, I used to have people who copy me off of my tests, make fun of me, call me Medusa ugly uh, them just doing certain things and I think I've told this story before about how motherfuckers literally that test they will copy after you and I learned this a long time ago motherfuckers can copy after you but when I change and I know that you copying after me. And I changed my answers. And had to memorize changing my answers. Right before I handed the paper in. I knew that motherfucker was going to be mad at me. But that's what you get. Is that. Uh, uh oh I fucked up. Uh oh. Boo boo myself. Okay, that type of energy. And they get mad because they couldn't swindle you. Child. I remember they named it everything. I remember what test we was taking. The day, the shirts, the pants, and the shoes that I had the fuck on that specific day. I vowed to never let that motherfucker copy off of me. So somebody's mad that you blowing up. They couldn't hold you back. Even if they try to 
find out some sort of secrets of yours to use against you. And I told you I didn't have people try to use my adoption against me. Every relationship I get in, that's why your mama don't want you. I've heard it all before, my love. Okay? <laughs> you can't tell me nothing that I ain't already heard before. Give it to me for my Pisces spirit. Puppet. And high adrenaline. So somebody wanted you to go along with their story. Okay, or their narrative. Play their little game. You got El Toxica and Toxico. Pisces. We already doing this shit. Bitch, buckle up. Reminisce at the bottom of the deck. So somebody's mad that they found out that they're toxic. They're unwanted. And unwarranted. Who's this about, Spirit? Social media. Twilight Zone at the bottom of the deck. So all the crazies. Also drive by and transform. Uh, there's that black and mouth. So somebody smoke black and mouth or something. Give it to me for my Pisces. They might hit a little something when they get pressed and distressed. Who's mad? They might hit a little Marlboro menthol that they ain't never hit before. Or a, 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 a new pork. Probably complain about you smoking cigarettes and... They need to hit that hole. <laughs> okay. You also have visit and pretend. So yeah, they're pretending. Paparazzi here. So you know they in the bushes. And also beef. That's who's mad. They got beef with you. What's this beef here for, Spirit? Give it to me for my Pisces. What's this beef here for? Selling souls. Mm -mm -mm. Give me some more. Arouse. So somebody that you uh, you may not be turned on from this person anymore. Okay, somebody could be mad that you're not sharing their little sexual demons with each other and shit. Mind, mind souls too trying to keep shit connected with cords that needed to be disconnected a long time ago you also have pipe dreams so they didn't follow along with the plan that they thought that they envisioned in their head and it all went to crumble I was telling my kids that like some of these barns and houses that we've been seeing on the road that's straight up strictly abandoned. Well, first of all, I told them it's probably a reason. But I told them that that used to be somebody's dream. That was somebody that built something up. And that was all fucked up. Okay, I'm also seeing that you put smiles on people's faces or you make people laugh or you have the gift of gab and it's making somebody mad in a motherfucker. You got a party animal here. Okay, somebody's mad that you were turned off by them or turned them down or they felt rejected. You have news. Okay, hidden lovers. Okay, so this could be a third party situation or somebody's baby mama, baby daddy, somebody's ex. Okay, somebody's on a dating app on on Facebook, Instagram, social media, TikTok. They using certain things as a scapegoat, but they can't get away with it no matter how many questions you ask or what silence that you keep around. Makeup, skin, and hair. So somebody's mad about, I don't know if it's a hairstylist because I don't let nobody touch nothing of mine. Bitch, don't even uh, leave a uh, uh, a lip gloss laying around. Okay, I know where everything is at. I don't. I make sure don't nobody try to put no spell on me. 
undercover. That's who's mad. So something didn't work out right. They feel rejected or they feel like somebody's been scheming and plotting on them. What's this undercover here for? City. And salty. Right underneath that, let's see. The whole family. All right, give me some more, spirit. What does Pisces need to know about? Tragedy. So this is some sort of mind fuck. Okay, somebody's about to be exposed. You got chaos agents, so they tried to keep you like, um, in a in a in between choice or needing to figure something out. Chaos agent and unforeseen. Shit's about to go down. All because they mad. Very spiteful energy here. What is this about? Candle magic and talent. So I don't know if this is the ancestors helping you block something out with this come up. Okay, or somebody is finding out they are a weak link. And not you, Pisces. Bitch, please. Okay, this is a little liar. Or somebody that stalks you. And then, like I said, it's spiteful. So they be holding shit under their breath. Oh, I hate this motherfucker. You need to tell me my control is right underneath that. And let down. Okay, also love, mom. You didn't let him get to you. You holding it down. Okay, they don't want to romp on my Pisces. You got a mistake here. Let's get some cards. Maybe Larry here, y'all. Hey, here. He about to tell it all. All right, give it to me for my Pisces. What do they need to know about? I'm getting real gassy, so I know this person about to blow up. Or they walking around like that shit don't sting. My my kids, they be mad at me like, uh uh, mama. Mm. I'll do what I want. Can't nobody control my gas. Okay. Ten of Wands. There's multiple people that's mad. Excuse me. All right, here we go. Eight of Cups. Five of Cups at the bottom of the deck. They made a horrible mistake. Seven of Seven of Wands. Your stalker is mad. Yes, sir. What's this mistake that they made, Spirit? What's this mistake that they made, Spirit? Nine of Cups. So they overindulged in something, or they seeing you flourishing your happiness. Uh, Empress energy here, also two of Pentacles. So they tried to keep you in a in a balance. I also feel like somebody has um, ego issues or like an ego battle or something like that. Star energy, also justice. Okay, in the moon. So it could be another Pisces here. Aquarian energy. I'm also getting Leo, Sag, and Aries. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. All right, here we go. And Virgo. Judgment. Eight of Swords. So they tried to target you. Also a lover here as well. Could be a possible Gemini. And the Hermit. What I say, Virgo. You got the Magician at the bottom of the deck. So yeah, they feel bamboozled like a motherfucker. Like I said. They feel duped. And dumb. 
Okay, magician energy. You also have the Ten of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups. So they tried to stop your money flow or some sort of permanency or residency or um, something that was solid. Seven of Sword energy here. Okay. I also feel like you found out their secrets or you already know certain things or certain things in their phone or it's like you a detective or something and they mad about it. Empress energy here and also chariot. So somebody is mad about the truth, about how somebody uplifts you or like I said, could be juggling two different energies or two different people. This could be like a baby mama, baby daddy or um, ex, okay, or somebody that they try to keep you in competition with. You do have the two of, two of cups and also the fool. Give me some more for my Pisces. Temperance and the Ace of Swords. Okay, also the Temple. So yeah, they are the weakest thing. Six of Wands here. They, um, your person is definitely. They feel stupid. Like I said, you got the fool of the world, the Six of Wands here. Like they did something dumb, and the devil. So it could have been due to their addictions of stalking you or some sort of drug addiction. But it's making them feel like they got to stay up. The ghost ghouls and goblins is after them. All right, let's get some of these witchy cards and then your girls out. All right, here we go. Give it to me for my Pisces. Let's get these together. You got secrets and go away. So whoever this weak link is, it's a dry spell. Alright. And then you got music here, so I don't know if they're a competitor or this is Lucifer or Lilith. And then bombs. technology all right so somebody mad about finding out information or trying to pay to shut you up and to go away they mad about that they probably didn't pay some sort of witch or some wiccan or warlock or whatever hope to make the situation just automatically go away and now they feel foolish because they didn't somebody then uh got swindled about their money or something Okay. They feel finessed. This also could be a business deal. What is this behind finesse? Change the narrative and natural disaster. So they feel finessed and they mad about it. They about to blow themselves up system crash so this could be actual electronics or technology you got angels in the outfield look at that shit somebody switching accounts here stalking you I feel like this is somebody's karma getting ready to come up okay paid to go away and memory magic somebody's mad about them being hit they got a lot of you got a lot of successful energy here and then being like it's some sort of crash but successful is here. So you could have been successful with uh, blocking this energy out or the angels is covering you. But I feel like whoever's mad, there could be something about tattoos or piercings or somebody's appetite. Getting Sagittarian energy for show. Okay, and also somebody that was sent to bring some chaos. And you didn't charm your way up out of this motherfucker. But they didn't lost out on some money or this could be hidden lovers of people that, like I said, 
on social media scamming and stealing and shit. That's sad. So it's a tragedy coming just because they mad about it. All right, Pisces, I love you guys all so much. Let me know what you all think in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.